Hello everyone, our group would like to talk about hard system thinking. First of all, we will talk about what is hard system thinking. Next, we will bring in the hard system model and finally we will provide an example. In hard system thinking, an objective or end to be achieved and you need to achieve the stated objective. A representation of the real world, use where the degree of clarity and stability is high and the problem is clearly defined. People and organization are not taken into account. The data style of the system is quantitative. The hard system thinking goal obtain the best solution and the outcome is tangible. Now, we proceed into the process of system engineering. First, we define the problem and then choice of objective and followed by system synthesis that is a combination of an idea, system analysis, system selection, followed by system development and the last one is current engineering that is we start to implement it. Now, let us look into an example. Step 1. Recognizing the problem. A boy found that he is poor in English. It is difficult for him to make the transition from Malay to English. Step 2. Defining the problem. A boy is poor in English and he wants to master English language and speak fluently in English within two years during his college life. Step 3. Analyzing the problem. He has a poor English base, he is Malay educator, there is no English environment, not receive enough input in English, lazy and not interested in learning English, use mother tongue to converse with his parents and friends. Step 4. Possible solution. Accomplished by reading an English language newspaper or listening to an English news podcast on the radio or TV. Sign up for a conversation class with a native speaker. Start speaking English with his best friend. Read something interesting, surf to English language sites on the web. Read a good book in English. Simply read something that interests him, something that won't bore him to death. Step 5. Criteria of an ideal solution. Get lots of professional students in excellent English. They can to really enjoy the experience and having fun in the class. Learn from the mistake. Motivate and learn from each other. Keep something English on him all day and every day. Step 6. Best solution. Sign up for a conversation class with a native speaker. Step 7. Implementing the solution. Take an English speaking tour or activity holiday. Foster interest in learning English language. May benefit from taking an active part in role plays of drama activity. Joining a short intensive course could produce better results than joining a course that could take place once a week for 6 months. And the last step, reviewing the success. He is now comfortable speaking in English. He can speak and express in English friendly, much more fun in delivering of and conversations in English. And his vocabulary is sufficient and will not get sentence master mixed up. So that's all for our topic today. Thank you and have a nice day.